I am most happy to be here this afternoon because I have many of my students here. Number one is your chairman. He is my wonderful student. Number two, Mohan is my student. Number three, Manigandan is my student. Number four, Tirnavakkar's IPS is my student. Number five, Pahalavan IPS Chennai Commissioner is my student. And I was the director of IAS Academy in Hyderabad. I was able to produce 34 IAS officers in this country. When I say IAS or IPS, it is not impossible from the eighth standard onwards, if you streamline the children towards civil services, every boy, every girl can become an IAS or IPS. It is not impossible. Therefore, I want your chairman to introduce special training for IAS and civil services along with the NEET examinations. NEET examinations will take you to engineering, they will take you to medicine, and these civil services examinations require a special type of simple training and uh, I am sure your chairman will introduce that. Now, just two points I speak and sit because we want to see the performance of the children. Number one, I do not know why your chairman called it rishis. Rishis are the ancient thinkers, researchers, teachers, preachers, practitioners of our country. In every walk of life, in every field of study, we had rishis. Vishwamitra is a rishi in spiritual lore. Vyasa Maharshi is a rishi in teaching specialities. Agastya is a rishi in food habits. Bharadwaja is a rishi in fearlessness. Each rishi has done research in any particular field. And they have propagated that. If anybody does research now, we give him a PhD degree call him a doctorate. In the ancient days, if anybody did research, he was called a Rishi, Rajarshi, Maharshi, Devarshi, Brahmarshi. They were all the PhD degree holders in one subject or another. The students coming to this institution will become PhD holders, DLIT holders in physics, in chemistry, in mathematics, in information technology, in history, in geography, in computer science, in law, in commerce. Therefore, I think your chairman has called this school Rishi's school where the students will become all great scholars. Point number three, the last point. I was the principal of Vivekananda College. I was also the principal of the National Defense Academy, Kadakwasla, Pune. This Vivekananda College is a college of discipline. National Defense Academy was also an institution of discipline. 
I explain, describe the discipline of NDA. We invite a chief guest. He will stand with, near the flag mast. He will pull the wire. Slowly the flag will go to the top. It gets unfurled. From the left side, three helicopters move. One helicopter will drop the rose petals. Another helicopter will drop the jasmines. Another helicopter will drop the green leaves. All the three will fall on the flag and they fall on the head. If it is one minute late, why one minute? Two seconds late, the flowers will fall the other side. Precision, perfection, punctuality, strict discipline. Otherwise, the petals will not fall on the national flag and from the national flag on the head of the chief guest. Imagine how much training I give to the three helicopters and the three pilots. Imagine how the chief guest has to draw the flag. So precise in life, we'll be most successful if we are disciplined. Swami Vivekananda went to America. He looked at the American gathering. He told them, you Americans, you have no brains. We Indians, we have intelligence. We have brains. But you are an advanced country. We are not a developed country. Reason, however intelligent we are, we don't have discipline. You don't have brains, but you have discipline. Robert Clive came to India. He's a clerk in the East India Company. He brought half a dozen people. He conquered the entire land. He established the British Empire because he is disciplined. We are 33 crores of people then. We did not have discipline. We became slaves for everybody, for everything to shine, to become successful. What we require is discipline. If my students are there all over the world, it is because of the excellent discipline they have learned in my college. Then you may ask, what is discipline, sir? Three sentences. Discipline of a place, discipline of a time, discipline of a procedure. What is discipline of a place? Have a place for everything, have everything in its place then and there. For example, you take your kitchen, you have the sugar bottle, you have the salt bottle. They are just above you. Electricity failed. There is a darkness. You are preparing a coffee. You can close your eyes, raise your hand, take the sugar bottle. If the bottles are misplaced, you will put salt in the coffee. The chair, the shirt, anything you keep in its place, you need not waste your time to search. You need not waste your energy. You need not waste your money. Very easily you will be in a position to find out where the objects are. Similarly, the mind. The student goes to the classroom. English, the door is open. English is learnt, door is closed. Mathematics is learnt, door is open, again it is closed. There are many cells, rooms in the mind. 
when that subject is taught the door opens when the subject is learned the door gets closed you become a master otherwise mind becomes a dustbin in the same dabba you put english in the same dabba you put mathematics in the same dabba you put physics and they all get mixed up when you want you cannot get anything so first is discipline of a place physically mentally give the place due to the wife give the place due to your mother give the place due to your friend don't mix them life is pleasant life is compartmentalized life is simple two discipline of time have a time for everything have everything in its time i had been to japan and there they go by seconds you get into the train you ask your neighbor where is venice tokyo sir 820 sharp the train stops and that is tokyo so precise they are in the second world war time japan was ruined nagasaki hiroshima were devastated completely ruined but today japan is once again a superpower what is the secret punctuality 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 have a time for everything have everything in its time cooking time speaking time play time study time luxury time cinema time you draw your program go by the program your mind is free you have enough time a busy man has time to do anything everything a lazy man does not have time to do anything i repeat the sentences a busy man has time to do everything a lazy man does not have time to do anything because there is no punctuality this is number 2 3 have a procedure for everything and have everything done according to the procedure to write a leave letter there is a procedure to write a complaint to the police officer there is a procedure in the seventh standard english teacher tells you how to write a leave letter how to write a complaint and for the grown up adults there is a procedure to write a love letter also karmanye vadhikaraste ma paleshu kadachana bhagavad gita krishna says follow the procedure if the electrician follows the procedure arranges everything systematically you need not be afraid switch on lights will be bright if the electrification is not proper everywhere anything may be dangerous there may be shock discipline is a very simple word sincerity is a very simple word simplicity is a simple word they will take you to the top this lavanya shobhana misses tirunavakkar so i went to their house tirunavakkar so is an ips man he is a senior most police officer holding the highest position i went to their house two three times in their house there is no dining table they sit on the floor and eat if anybody cannot sit on the floor they make a temporary arrangement they lead a very very simple life and they never take food without prayer brahmarpanam brahmahavi what i taught in my college before taking food 
that prayer they make i taught them simplicity i taught them austerity i taught them discipline they are shining all over the world wherever i go i have my students giving me the utmost satisfaction i am glad i happen to be the teacher of very very bright good students like your chairman thank you very much god bless you